MB04. No, MB03. But it is 2024, I think. Anyway, Friday the 23rd of February, Hereford. The car is already misting up. I'm going later today because, well, it's a Friday and things. <sighs> anyway, see you there. It's Hereford. And it was sunny until I got here. And now it's raining a lot. Behind me, the travel lodge. Change beats first. Oh. Weather. Oh, then uh, Costa Coffee, then the Orange Tree. I think this is new. Anyway. The Orange Tree. <laughs> Great welcome here. This is Don't Give a Rack. Uh, Ruby. Faces Flutcher Brewery. It's up there. Four point five percent alcohol by volume. Looks nice, and we got the rolls. Nice carpet, nice and warm. No, the Wi-Fi yet. Guess I'm another time. Hmm. Fruity, citrusy. Sharp, a little bit malty, a plus and a bit. A sharp, bitter, lingering finish. It'll do with the rolls. And the music, that'll be a takedown. Still got the ham salad roll to eat. Hogsback, so near and yet so far. 4.4% alcohol by volume. Let's have a look on the board. Exactly called England's Glory. Whatever. <laughs> At least it's English. Mm. Malty, fruity, rich. It says golden. I'm going with amber. B plus in a bit. Fruity bit of finish. A stout, very nicely presented, black beard, brackets mocha, from Bolson's Brew Co. Um, Weatherby, 4.3% alcohol by volume. Nice and cool. Okay, so, very coffee, mocha. Uh, chocolatey, fruity, bitter, burnt notes, the plus and a bit. <laughs> Checked in, here we are, beer in hand, for beer. First of all, in a left-handed giant glass, from London, Gravity Well Brewery, Smelloscope, colon, NZH Z dash 101 New Zealand, I'm guessing. Nice bit of floral in this mm. Fruity, more tropical than fruity. A little bit sweet. Tropical bit of finish. It's really nice. B plus and a bit and a bit because why not? Also, in a left 